what's going on it's Saw dudes my name is Dean and in the background you are watching some overwatch gameplay now this particular gameplay is me using Zarya on defense and uh, yeah it kind of fits into the topic of what I want to talk about and what I want to discuss today now I did a video last week I think it was discussing how my previous season went how season 3 went for me and today I want to talk about my plans for season 4 and what my plan of attack is to get better at the game and what I want to specifically do to do that. Now, I think, of course, the objective for every season for everyone is just get to the highest rank possible and do the best you can and learn the game dynamics a little bit more and play as much as you can. I, I think that's a pretty basic standpoint. So yeah, of course, that's what I want to do. But my primary goal for this season is to start playing the tank heroes a little bit more because this previous season, I have always actually, not even just this previous season, Overall, my experience with Overwatch has always been to play a mixed bag of heroes, and the DPS or the uh, offensive heroes have always been kind of my favorite ones to play. And I'm starting to realize after, uh, again, check that video out I did last week about how my season went. But anyway, I'm starting to realize after that previous season when I started to just fall towards the end that I'm probably not a DPS player. That's not really where... I fall in line and I kind of want to not main because I don't know that I necessarily believe in the idea of having a main in overwatch and I'll, I'll do a video on that in the future but uh, I, I don't necessarily agree with the idea of having a main in overwatch but I do agree that if you start playing an individual hero a bunch you're going to start picking up tendencies and doing a little bit better with that hero you start to know the dynamics a lot more and uh, that's kind of what I want to do in this upcoming season I've decided that for this this upcoming season I'm going to play exclusively Reinhardt and Zarya now of course if those are taken I'll figure out something and maybe play something else but for the most part I really do want to just focus on those two heroes and the reason that I chose those two heroes specifically is because I found myself when I look back at some of my gameplay and I just kind of you know, stopped and thought about my play style. I realized that a lot of the times I'm running towards the front of the fight and it's not really a good idea to generally do that, but it is dependent on the hero you're playing. And so I thought about this for a while and I tried to think about which heroes really need to be at the front of the charge. And the two that stuck out the most that made the most sense were Zarya and Reinhardt. Reinhardt definitely is always going to be in the front. He's the big barrier that's going to protect you from the, the offensive heroes that are coming in. And that's his primary goal. And with Zarya, you really want to be in front to charge the bubbles. And that's kind of where I decided, you know what, these are the heroes that I want to practice and I really want to do great with. I want to become great with a hero because as it stands right now I think I'm good with a lot of heroes I don't think I'm great though and I've got to work on that I've got to get better at individual heroes because that's where my ranks gonna start to go up once I finally know that I can put on Zarya and I can really really be helpful to the team or I can play a Reinhardt who's a super useful hero in general like I think those are the two most important heroes in overwatch now again overwatch is a team game so I'm not gonna solo I'm not gonna well I mean I will play solo at times I'm sure but what I mean by that is I'm not going to solo carry just learning these players it's not gonna be like that but I'm definitely going to be able to pick up a few things just playing these heroes a lot more playing the tank heroes that I specifically want to and that's kind of my plan of attack for this upcoming season I, I think it's a good idea I really do like I said I played a lot of DPS last season and in the first season first two seasons I really didn't know what I was doing specifically but in the previous season that was when I really learned overwatch I think that's when I really learned to know what I'm doing and in that season, I really played a lot of DPS, and I don't think that's my role. Like, I think I'm good with Soldier, specifically, but like with the other DPS heroes, I don't think I'm that great, and I think I can definitely improve at that, and maybe that's something I'll do in quick play, but I really want to specifically get better with an individual hero. And again, I don't necessarily buy into the concept of maining, picking a hero, and just playing as that hero. I'll do a video on that in the future, like I said, kind of talking about that a little bit more, but Overwatch is just a game that's based on switches and countering your opponent, so I don't really agree with that. And that's pretty much my plan of attack, and also, you know, get as high as I possibly can in terms of rank and just do the best that I can and learn the game more. That's that's my plan for this season. So I want to know, is there something you specifically want to learn this season? Is there a hero you want to pick up and learn a little bit more? Is that something that you guys have planned? Let me know, because I'm very curious if you guys 
definitely want to do that or not. And that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like. And if not, feel free to give it a dislike. And thank you so much for watching. And other than that, guys, I will see you in the comments below. Peace.